Now, with the, the changes where I was born and grown up in the country, I didn't born in down, I was born in the bush. And with that, uh, we live off a of bush land. That was, we got a part of a supermarket in the bush, in the country. Also with them, all our bush food uh, destroying it as well, going away. Anyway, uh, when I grown up, all through, everything was very neat, and uh, lots of different plants, soil, you know, the country ways, all looking good all the way. Every year when we grown up, we went out bush in the field. Many big rivers was very deep. You couldn't see the bottom of it. Now everything changing on the river as well. And then uh, wherever we went, when we grown up a bit, I become a little stockman. Then when we was out in the run, you know, rounding up cattle in some places. Till we grown a bit further, we seen the range with early days, well, I'm talking about back from the 40s, up to 50, we have a, October with our big rain, we call that thunderstorm coming. Rain is you ain't gonna start. Then uh, you stop and change your plan and get rid of everything. Everyone has to go out on holiday. They call it a walkabout. Then the way, uh, then it rain. You'd get a rain from October. November it started to get bigger. And Jan January and February used to be monsoon rain. And March was the knock em down rain. The knock em down mean the rain come down and knock all the grass down. And that tells you the rain is finished when the, uh, the grass was knocked down. Now, you don't see any of them grass knocked down these days. Everything has changed from 40 to 50, 55. Then you get all this very big rain with a lot of water in the soil and the spring, the billabong they call, they were full. Now, the later, up to around about 1955, everything was changing, what they call a drought. The drought was, used to come on, you know, around from August, all through sometime, all through the, hardly any rain, it was any little drizzle rain, wouldn't fill up the river, wouldn't fill up any uh, billabongs, they call, None at all. Grass wouldn't grow. Everything was just bare because that was a big drought. Didn't have much of a food for stock, you know, but all this. Some place we had to go down and chop trees with axe, so leaves, so all, the cattle can eat, you know, because the country was pretty bare from the big drought. And they, uh, in early day in the past, a lot of old people, the Aboriginal people, they were the rainmaker. They could sing a rain to come down, you know, and make every year. But all us, all, all rainmaker, and all dead and gone. You know, nobody, you know, didn't pass, pass the song and everything to them enough. We do the young one today, you know, because of the policy come in with the government when they change it to everyone have to come equal and all this sort of type, and that's destroyed the the full culture from the Aborigines, you know. There was a singer for rain, for snake bite or whatever, they cured themselves with all the song in the early days that I can remember. You know, and now all them's are gone, and that's why the, all the, everything uh, uh, changes, the only drought come. The drought come, the river's getting shallow, spring was gone dry, you know, um, everywhere. Then we saying, well, What's going on? What happened? We saw the first one back in 1966, uh, round about that year, I think. This 
uh, what's the rocket gone up to the moon? We said, well, rocket gone up to the moon, it'll bug it all well. That's what we said. What's that mean? Because they're touching the moon, you shouldn't be interfering with the moon. That's when it changed. Everything now was climate change. Today, you know, all over. And we shine, we don't know what's going to happen. Because big blues are up in the air, everything going crazy in the country. It's a spiritual to turning everything over, you know, in the country. You know, uh, he's sitting there, twisting your mind around, to spinning it, to saying that something got to destroy either. Spiritual can dry the whole land, we can stay in no water. Or we can get a big flood, swipe the whole country. Or maybe we can get a cyclone. We never had a cyclone. We had a bit of windstorm and all that in the early days, but there was no cyclone. Like the big uh, flying uh, wind and take the roof off or something like that. But not continue big flood and everything. Didn't have any of those sort of things. Now today that everything is changing. The world turning around to, to look at all of us. And he said, well, these people gone crazy. We've got to do something about the land. That's what the, they can overturn the all, everything over. You know, not only in Australia, but it'd be here too, all over. What that mean? You get force people to do all sorts of different mischief, get up to all the different mischief. The mischief mean like a, they could be doing a lot of other bad things, burning off houses or burning off a big fight, killing one another, or the big wind can come along and destroy everybody out of hand, you know, and, and all this sort of type. And that's what we all people now we said, we said, everything going really mad. We're trying to explain it all the young one today. You know, saying that uh, you just got to listen and understand what the law mean. You know, you just can't go out of hand and do what you like. You got to come back and listen to what the atmosphere will come. The spiritual the thing that can watch us, you know, we say. Now, because of the rocket was up in the moon, you don't know what's going to happen. It could just come dark all of a sudden, we'll have no moon left. Or it could just they tell our sun to come down low and cook to all of us. You know, or something will might be changing, is it? Get the flood water back and swipe the whole country. Or get the big flood and swipe all the big town where they are. Well, I might say, oh, might a big cyclone will come along and just swipe the whole township away. And that will include with a earthquake. Come to combine in one. The rainbow underneath in the spiritually take the soil away from you, you can put it down. And they connect with the uh, with the earthquake too, all that sort of thing. Then you got the stars, then the moon and all them there. They're all looking from top. You know, in the spiritual. We more or less on a new generation under a new spiritual world. That's what we are now.